and they're not supposed to do that and so i got really uncomfortable i'm just absolutely exhausted isn't this so cute big day got canceled not canceled but oh no this is the setup i'm gonna be completely honest i just kind of cried for a little okay i got my schedule <gasps> what no Hello, good morning. Very early. It's 7 o'clock. Today is technically the second day of Rush, but it's the first day that I'm actually talking to girls, and I'll kind of explain that. When I get ready, I'm Audrey. I'm going to be a freshman. I go to the University of Texas at Austin. I have to be on Zoom at 9, so I'm going to get ready now and kind of talk to you guys about the process and just... Throughout this week, I'm going to be sharing the overall experience being online. I'll just talk about it as we go. Okay, welcome to my desk area. I sat in bed for like 30 minutes after that first clip and ate breakfast. I had a yogurt. I didn't really want to go to the dining hall. The dining hall kind of scares me still, I'm not going to lie. Anyway, I don't know where to start. Basically, it's all online this year except for possibly one part of bid day. Bid day is Monday. Yesterday was technically the first day of recruitment. A few weeks ago, we sent them a two minute video like introducing ourselves. And then yesterday, they sent back like a three minute video. There's 14 sororities at my school. Yesterday, we ranked our top 10. Um, I think that's the right wording for it, is ranking it. So yesterday, they, I guess they watched our video. I feel like they've been watching our video for the past week or whatever. And then we watched all 14 of their videos. I'm just gonna like try to explain the whole process as best as possible because i know i didn't completely understand it and like i'm i just want to explain it because i think it's a cool process so you have recruitment guides which we call rogans they are sorority girls but they completely like disaffiliate from their sorority and they're here just to answer any questions we have and help us through the process on monday we had zoom calls with them we had like a speaker just kind of like learning about the process and then yesterday we met with them and they showed us all of the videos of the sororities and then they help you rank at the end of the day you can't rank without like talking to them so you could talk through stuff with them what else what else then this morning at nine we get our schedule so basically i find out if anyone dropped me i will talk to them for the next two days so the next two days this philanthropy round so i'll talk to up to 10 houses and then friday and saturday are a different round i'll talk about that when i get there the videos were super cute they were all just so different so it's hard to tell and like i'm basically going off of people's instagrams and those like three minute videos so i'm excited to like actually talk to people and make connections with them hopefully so my roommate isn't here yet which is very good i don't really have to find a place to go i can just do it in my room she gets here on friday though so we'll deal with that when we get there so each day for each round i guess there's different dress codes and they basically get more formal as they go today we have to wear a ut t-shirt honestly i'm so glad that it's online because i was really stressing about outfits for a really long time and now i just have to worry about the top half like i don't have to worry about finding comfortable shoes to walk forever in but like still be formal usually you'd be outside in the heat all day like walking from each house so i feel like this will be a little less stressful okay so i'm going to finish my makeup and then i will show you guys my outfit i think i'm ready i'm just wearing my UT t-shirt and then I'm wearing sweatpants because they're not going to see it right now I'm going to basically set up my like zoom station I think I want that to be my background so that's what I'm going to do right now I still have like an hour left I'm ready pretty early I'm obsessed with my room and I don't know this is probably coming out before my room tour but here's a little sneak peek I love it so much I'm going to try something crazy just I mean I can't get up on my bed though Yeah, that's too tall. That's good because I wouldn't be able to get down from my bed very easily if I need to get up. Too short though. Love it. Okay, I'm gonna set up lighting. A bunch of like online recruitment advice suggested that you get a ring light and i was like well i feel like i don't really need that but then i was like i'm a youtuber <laughs> like i'm gonna need lighting and i left my lighting at home because i couldn't pack it 
so i decided to buy lighting anyways i didn't buy a ring light i bought this like other lighting system but i honestly feel like if i wasn't a youtuber i probably wouldn't have spent money on that because i would have just used my desk lamp like i'm doing today because my lighting didn't come in on time that's like what my background looks like i don't think i like the lighting but i'm gonna just fix it it's a little harsh my green wall kind of makes things darker than i would like but it's eight o'clock and i'm kind of just going to chill out until i have to get on because I have everything set up now and now I don't have to stress, so. I'm kind of nervous. I haven't gotten my schedule yet, but I'm trying to remember that basically these girls are like almost the same age as me. They went through it also, so I'm just trying to stay cool. I'll like start to get a little bit nervous and I'll be like, no, it's fine, it's fine. Also, another thing before you start, I have a notebook and some pens to take notes. I took notes yesterday too, and it really helped just remembering everyone. Yeah, I'm actually really excited. We're just waiting. I think for everyone to get on, the first thing is like a live YouTube video where they're gonna talk to us for like 20 minutes and then I get my schedule after that, so. Okay, so I got my schedule for the next two days. Kind of have a lot of gaps. Today I don't start till 1.30, so I suddenly have a lot of time, but it's fine. I need to edit a ton of videos anyways. I kind of thought that I was gonna like dive right into it, but I, Still have till 1.30, so... I've talked to two houses so far. I'm waiting in to get the next one, but I literally just had a crazy Wi-Fi scare. Um, nothing is loading, so I turned my computer off and turned it back on, and I made it in time. So it's about to start, but I just wanted to update you on what virtual recruitment is like. Hey, hello. I talked to four houses. They were all like back to back, and now I have an hour break. I have like 30 minutes left in my break. I just have one more, and then I'm done for the day. It's really fun because I like miss talking to people, and like meeting new people is really cool. And I was totally like on a roll, really energetic, but now that I have a break, like it's starting to sink in, like how tiring it is. Just like, it's just like socially exhausting, if that makes sense. Mentally exhausting, maybe, is the word for it. I don't know. It's 5.45 and I'm officially done with like half of the first round, um, second round, I guess. I don't really know. My first one is at 9.45 and so I will see you all then and show you what I'm wearing. So it's going to be the exact same thing for tomorrow. Okay, it's day two. I woke up really early and I went for a run and then I showered, but my hair is like not completely dry yet, so I didn't want to straighten it. So I just straightened like these like two pieces. Today I have one this morning and then I have a huge break until this afternoon and I have my rest. So I'm just gonna do touch-ups then. But for this one, we're just gonna pretend like I have my hair. And I there's this weird piece that keeps sticking out. I don't know if I like burned off my hair. It didn't smell like it at all and I don't see, like I don't know what that is. Isn't that weird? Okay, I'm currently eating a tortilla. I have one more left of philanthropy round. Starting to get really tired, but then like once I start talking to the girls, it's really fun and I'm not as tired. I really liked everyone so far. Been taking a lot of notes. I had one this morning and then I had like a really long break. I went to lunch with my mom and then I came back and I have four in a row. Each of them are 30 minutes long and then there's 15 minutes in between each of them. So in total, I've talked to 10 houses in philanthropy round, which is the max that you can talk to which is really cool <laughs> that i was able to do that you get put into a big one and they show you like a video about their philanthropy and then you get to break out into breakout rooms with up to four girls so i've talked to a lot of people which is cool so i actually get to know them even though it's online so i have 10 more minutes till my next one so i log on like about five to ten minutes before and you're just in the waiting room and then they let you in when it's time so i kind of just sit here on my phone i'm gonna finish my tortilla and i am almost done with the first day no second day first round second round i'm almost done with today okay guys i'm about to talk to my program to rank i have no idea how i'm gonna rank it i totally thought i did and then i just don't now so i'm gonna talk to my program and like kind of get advice from her i've just been kind of sitting about it going over my notes thinking about it because I want more houses than I can choose. I have to decide who I want to put as like my second, first, first, second option. Basically, I choose six houses and then if those six houses choose me, then I talk to those six houses in the next round. If one of those six houses don't choose me, my seventh choice bumps up to that spot. So I could possibly just get the ones that I want if I get dropped by another one, but I don't know. My program helped me so much. Oh, I feel so much better about like what I decided and stuff. Yeah, she just helped me so much. So I'm very grateful for her. And the fact that I just, I just kind of like talked it through with her and it was philanthropy around. So I was going over like 
what philanthropies I liked and what's important to me and like just talking it all out. Very happy about that and I'm excited for tomorrow. I'm kind of nervous for tomorrow morning to see my schedule and see if like some of the stories that I liked didn't necessarily like want to talk to me back or like want me back and hopefully it'll be good news and I'll be happy with my schedule and if not like I should be happy anyways because everything works out so yeah okay so it's really late on still the same day but another part of my bro gaming so cute she dropped off this cute little tumbler that says texas panholinic and then a straw and then it came with a cute little sticker that says go greek and she just wrote me two little notes these are a list of my favorite dessert places near and far from campus in case you're in need of a pick me up and then she wrote me like a handwritten note too and it's so cute <sighs> okay i'm going to go to sleep i just said goodbye to my mom <laughs> kind of sad but this was so sweet and then i got my lighting from amazon but i'm not gonna set it up um i guess now that i'm here i was gonna tell you tomorrow morning but the day got canceled not canceled but there was supposed to be one part where we were still able to go to the house and take photos but they canceled that part so now it's all virtual which is like obviously a lot safer but like still kind of sucks not having that as of right now but it'll be it'll still be fun i mean obviously it's still a bit day it's just like definitely not anywhere near what i was expecting i'm gonna go to sleep now and i'll see y'all tomorrow for sisterhood round good morning everyone i had a dream about what sororities wanted me i just yeah i think today i'm going to do my hair i'm gonna wait on my makeup and then if i have a meeting at 10 i'm gonna do my makeup in 30 minutes which is completely fine for me um i can have up to six houses today this round's also two days too so it'll be today and tomorrow Okay, so this is the first dress. It's from Free People, but it doesn't look that good in the camera, I think. I don't know if you can tell, but like it kind of just looks like I like just have like a basic top on. Okay, this is dress two. I just got it. It's actually like so short for me, like insanely short. <laughs> Um, but I'm just doing sweats. It's actually not awful. I have, like, I don't, I know you can't, like, barely tell, but. Okay, I decided that I'm going to try my other one on, and then if that one's, like, awful, I'll go with this one, because this one isn't bad, but it's not the best. Okay, so this one definitely looks better with my hair. See how it looks on camera? I don't know. Yeah, I think I'm gonna wear pearls with this one. Yeah, that is super cute. Okay, basically it's a YouTube live is the meeting at the beginning and then we meet with her road games and we get our schedules and I'm really nervous about it. I'm actually really nervous about it, but it is what it is. Everything works out. I'm just kind of scared that I'm going to look at it and I'm going to have no houses, which is not really logistic thinking unless something like terrible happened. I forgot to say that this dress is from Vici. It's actually from like a ton of different boutiques and I found it a lot of different places, but I've shopped at Vici before, so I bought it from them, but they don't do returns. It's like only store credit, but I think it'd be so cute if I like cut here here and made this a skirt but the top is cute for zoom so that's all that matters in minutes till the schedule comes out i'm so nervous i'm about to join the zoom meeting with my rogam group because we have to open the schedule in front of them which is like weird but <sighs> oh my gosh okay so we're on there at 9 30 and that's when schedules are going to come out and then at 9 30 she got a text our rogam saying that schedules weren't gonna be out until 9.45. So then we were just like talking till 9.45 and then they sent a schedule and basically they're pushing back all the events till 12.45 and we don't know when we're gonna get our schedule. But yeah, I was really scared when they said that the schedules were coming out at 9.45 that I was gonna get the first slot and I would have 15 minutes to do my makeup but now I have forever, so. Guys, I just wanna know my schedule. <laughs> I want to know who wanted me back and who didn't and if it was like the people that I liked uh, It's just really stressful and I don't want to get dropped by a bunch, but that's how it is I'll let y'all know when I get my schedule, but just a little update and it hasn't happened yet Okay, it's 12 15 and it still hasn't come out yet <gasps> Okay, it came out Oh no Okay it's okay <laughs> there were two that i really wanted that were my tops this whole time and they dropped me but it's okay because they weren't meant to be but my first one isn't until 4 50 so i just did my makeup for nothing again and i only have one event today and most of mine are tomorrow so okay 
gonna be completely honest i just kind of cried for a little but that's fine i know this is like totally normal and rush and like i'm kind of just getting the full experience and it just wasn't meant to be right guys it's time for me to talk to my one and only call today i have a new lighting system i'm kind of nervous but i'm also just like mostly excited to talk to these girls again because all these houses i know i was sad earlier but like still all the houses that i have left over i like really had good connections with the girls so kind of turned around my like mental way of thinking it and now i'm excited to talk to the girls um even though i'm only talking to one today and then five houses tomorrow good morning it is saturday already um today is the second round of sisterhood i'm just doing my makeup jane went in last night my roommate she left to go back to where her family was staying this morning because we have zoom calls at the same time so i'm really glad that got figured out i was gonna go outside but it's raining so Good thing her parents are still here. I haven't liked my makeup for the past few days on Zoom. I kind of realized that yesterday. So I'm kind of just winging it today. Okay, I don't know the last time I talked, but I am so exhausted. <laughs> it was such a long day. And I had five Zoom meetings today. I like haven't really eaten. <laughs> I'm very tired and I feel good about my rankings though. So tomorrow I will talk to two people and it's prep night. It's the last day before bid day. And I feel good about it. I'm just absolutely exhausted. I don't know if you can tell, but um, I just want to take a nap really badly or just like i don't know i'm very tired i'm very glad i'm not like walking around from house to house because i know that is probably so much more exhausting but just like i haven't talked to people in forever because of quarantine and stuff talking to brand new people for so long is so fun and exciting but like when you get off you are exhausted that's a little update i'm gonna try to sleep early tonight because tomorrow's meetings are even longer and like they're really important because you make your final decision after them so i'm excited to see my schedule tomorrow to see if my top two houses also liked me okay it is the last day it's preference round so we have two houses i really like my dress for this one it's from aritzia these are from madewell and then these are from anthropology i haven't done my makeup yet because schedules come out at 9 30 and then again the first one's at 10. hopefully i just don't have the first event but if i do i'll just do my makeup really fast i really like it lately i've been wearing sweats but i'm just wearing shorts this morning yeah the dress looks really cute on zoom so i'm happy with this outfit my roommate jane is here and so hopefully we just get different event numbers but if not we'll just go one of us is gonna go out to the courtyard and do our zoom call and it won't be that big of a deal the events today are 50 minutes each and the previous days they've been 30 to 35 minutes so it's gonna be a longer time but we'll get to really know them a little bit more so i'm excited okay i got my schedule and i got the two that i put as my top so i'm very excited and my first one isn't until 1 so i can kind of just chill out i really need to edit and stuff like that so i'm very happy and then jane also got what she wanted we have the same event number for one of them but i think she's gonna go to her family friend's house because we know for sure that they have wi-fi and like stuff like that it's literally so nerve-wracking when you're like waiting for the schedule and like you keep refreshing and stuff like that but the, today's schedule is good better than yesterday's <laughs> I'm talking to them in about 30 minutes, 25 now. Um, I'm talking to my first house and then my second house of the day is later. Um, I am super excited. Like, I'm just very excited. And today I did less makeup than yesterday and I like it a lot more. I feel like I look like myself. I'm more comfortable even though today's like supposed to be like the fanciest. Earlier today I was kind of like going back and forth which one I like wanted. So so I'm really going into here like really wanting to like get to know um, them a little bit more before I make my final decision with my Rogam later. Yesterday a house asked me <laughs> how I was going to rank them and they're not supposed to do that and so I got really uncomfortable and I ended up not, I'm like not talking to them today so that's kind of awkward because i kind of made it sound like i don't like i really didn't know what to say in that situation and it was really uncomfortable they like basically asked me like if i was confident of who i was gonna put in my last four like they were setting it up i think to where like i was supposed to say like oh my god i love you guys so much but like 
I ended up not putting them in my top two. But that's just a little story time. They definitely weren't supposed to do that, I think. So hopefully no one asks me that again today because that was a really, it just kind of caught me off guard because they're not allowed to do that. So this is the setup that I have again. That light didn't work that well. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I'm just using my desk light still. Okay, I just got off with my first one. I talked to the same girls as I did yesterday and I love them so much. Like, it was such a good experience and I really think that that's where I belong and that's what I'm gonna go. Um, I'm still gonna talk to the second one and I'm really excited for that too because I love the girls that I talk to and like, I just like, they were so inspiring last time I talked to them. Just keeping my options open, but I really feel good about that last house. And yeah, I'm just in a really good mood. <laughs> Okay, I just finished my last one. I love all of the girls literally so much. I'm not even kidding. But I think I know like where I want to be. I don't know. There's a lot going on in my head right now. And like, I don't want to regret my decision, but I know that everything happens for a reason. I'm just trying not to think about it too much. Just like going based off of how I feel. But yeah, you kind of just get a feeling and like both of the feelings are like good, but one's just like a little bit more. And I think... That's where I can see myself. And so now I'm going to watch this little video. It's basically, I have to sign a contract that says like, my choice is my choice and like, I can't complain about it. Or like, I don't know. I said that in such a bad way. Basically that's what I'm doing right now. And then I'll rank and then it'll be the end of recruitment and bid day will be tomorrow. Bid day got pushed back till five, which kind of sucks, but it's okay. <laughs> um, I think they just like didn't want us to like, be tempted to go out and do stuff like for lunch and stuff if we had our bids at 11 30 so we're gonna visit five but yeah kind of a long time to wait a full 24 hours okay i just ranked and it feels so good i'm literally so happy oh my gosh yeah i'm just really 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 happy and i talked to two rogams my like one that i've been talking to and this other one who was like in our big subgroup i only talked to her once other before but they were both in there there's a certain app that you go on to rank and so they were like walking me through the app and then you have to get a password for them to like really rank it all but both of them like said that they like could really see it in my face that i was like really excited for the one that i chose and so that felt good and they were just really excited for me and like yeah they were just so sweet um and so now my roommate's gonna come back I'm gonna kind of chill until 5 p.m tomorrow i'm like so excited i literally can't wait hopefully i get my first choice and if i don't like i'm honestly going to be okay like i'm not gonna be mad about it because i liked the other one too but yeah so that's the end of recruitment but stick around because bid day is also gonna be in this vlog and it's gonna be very really interesting because it's all virtual and i hope it doesn't suck and i feel like it's not gonna suck because i'm gonna be really excited and yeah <laughs> Okay, it's a day. I'm wearing this little dress. They just said like in brunch attire. So this is from Princess Polly. We're like meeting in a YouTube live at five o'clock and I think we get our bids at 5.30. I'm not really sure. It's all gonna be virtual, but I'm very excited. And my roommate's in the same room as me today. And so we're gonna open our bids together. I'm kind of nervous that like they, I don't know. Like I'm pretty positive I know which one I'm gonna get because they were like so reciprocated of like how excited they were, but I don't know, part of me is scared that it's like not gonna work out, but it always works out, so it's okay. So um, yeah, I'm very excited. We're waiting to get oh, on Zooms God. with our Rogams. We just found out what sorority they're in, and I guess correctly, <laughs> um, and I'm starting to get nervous. I'm a little nervous, but I'm also really excited. Okay. Okay, we're logging on. Okay. I'll refresh when you get there. Okay. Okay. Ready? <laughs> Where does it say? Uh, Bid matching? View new membership? <gasps> <gasps> what? No! You're joking! Oh, oh my okay. god! What the heck? Stop! Oh I mean, I'm happy, what? but like, what? This what? is awkward, but I got alpha Kyle. <laughs> Yes, and now we can like meet different people. Exactly, and, and then it'll we can be make our friends. It'll be good. <laughs> okay, so now there's a video link, and we're gonna go to the video link and kind of just go, I guess, in different ones. We we're kind of expecting you in the same one. Yeah, but. they just dropped off. I still have my mask on because it was like so socially distanced. But they just dropped off my little bag. Isn't this so cute? Okay, let me go through it with y'all. Basically, they dropped off our like bid day baskets. They made me this cute little thing. And then I was on a Zoom call with everyone. I don't know when was the last time I updated y'all, but like I'm literally so happy and I talked to so many girls and they were so cute and like 
so nice and I'm just so, so happy. Okay, let's see what's in here. First, this super cute water bottle. Cute little fanny pack. Okay, there's something in the fanny pack. Necklace and a pin. Sticker and this is adorable. Look how cute that is. This is my bid card. This is what you usually open. And oh shoot, I can't open it. This is like what usually you would get and like you would open and like this is the first thing that you ever saw. And they included a Starbucks gift card. A cute little hat. Adorable. I don't know if any of y'all care. Two masks. Okay, this one's cute. This one's really cute. I didn't pack a lot of t-shirts for a reason. We have this shirt. I saw this girl had a shirt on. I was like, oh my gosh, that shirt's so cute. This is the bid day shirt. And all of them were wearing it on the Zoom. And they're so adorable. Yeah, that's my bid day. That's my whole rush week, guys. Like, rush is over now. But yeah, everything works out. I know that clip was kind of awkward, maybe, because um, we weren't expecting it. But Jane is seriously so happy with hers. Um, she went out to go get her basket right now. She, like, was talking to all the Zoom girls and like I think she definitely found her place so it totally works out for everyone no matter what like she's super happy now and like I'm super happy and I was talking to a bunch of people on zoom and like facetiming them and texting them and stuff like that so even though it's virtual it's still like the same amount of excitement and cuteness and like maybe not the same amount of cuteness but yeah so that's that thanks for watching my rush video and my bid day video and um yeah Thank y'all so much for watching. Follow me on Instagram. Go look at my bid day photos if I take some cute ones tonight alone. And, um, but yeah, I will see y'all in my next vlog. I just want to say I just had a mini heart attack because I thought I couldn't find my brush, but I found it. So everything's good now, but I just have my pillow just fell. I finished my makeup. I don't know if I like it or not, but I usually don't like my makeup anyways. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, I forgot to put a highlighter on. Maybe I'll do that. Does it matter on Zoom though? Yes, probably. Okay. While I was out there, I met someone. Oh shoot, my camera's gonna die.